Hey guys, as some of you guys may know, I am on winter break home from college. So I've had a lot of time here. So to cure some of my boredom, I have actually done a couple big things. One of the big things would be changing rooms with my sister. At first I was in complete denial. I was like, I'm not doing this. Absolutely not. Like you're not taking away my room because my room was like one thing that was familiar to me coming home from college. So I was like, I don't want to give that up yet, but it had to happen. And honestly, I, love this new space that i'm in you guys will notice that it's a bit of the same vibe as my last room just a little different a little bit more sophisticated ish we repainted this room kind of fixed it up a little bit and i got to really make it my own first i am going to show you a little behind the scenes um a little bit of me being in denial at first and then kind of a little bit of the process it's pretty short but you guys can skip to this time if you just want to see the room tour let's just go ahead and get started Hey guys, so this video is very bittersweet. Mostly bitter because I'm moving out of my room. <sighs> I've been like slightly anticipating this because my parents have like warned me like at some point you're changing rooms with your sister so she can have the bigger room since you're not here since you're in college but i really thought i could get out of it i lost the battle and i'm changing rooms with my sister because apparently she's now the favorite child and i'm getting the room that i started my channel in you guys will get to see that again um it's gonna look a lot different than it did when I started my channel, you can refer to the other videos if you really feel the need to. I wouldn't if I were you. It's not cute, but it's there. I've already taken down all my pictures that was on my wall over there. Like this whole wall, like when it faces like this way, you can't even see it. But it had a ton of pictures on it. It's actually kind of tragic though because all of them went from like freshman to sophomore year. So they weren't actually cute anyway, but it was a cute idea. And then I had all my pictures up on this little like thing those ones were from like junior year so they weren't like cute but it made the room way more like homey now it's like slowly just getting really sad in here so i'm kind of like ready to like go now it was fun while it lasted but you know what it's time to hand it to my sister because i just love her so much First, I'm gonna start off with this little corner. This is the door that you walk in, and then over here is the TV. We put up this TV, it has like a little sound bar, and it actually has a sub that is over there under my nightstand, which is so nice. Little addition that my dad added. But it has Roku, and I've honestly watched more Netflix this break than I have in my entire life. I have actually never been a TV person until I moved into this room. Over here is this little wood shelf. This can be decorated so much cuter, but I have a lot of decorations back at college. Also keep in mind, some of the stuff I'm gonna take back to college and some stuff I already have in college, I really worked with what I had. I just have my book that I've been reading, my little to-do list thing that I like to check off, some pictures, whatever, vitamins that I'm taking back to college, my fanny pack so I can just Grab that when I leave. I think this shelf is from Costco. My bedding is from JCPenney. And then I just have some random pillows over here because I have a couple pillows that I would usually throw on my bed in my dorm room. So I just kind of have all my pillows on one side and then just where I sleep. <laughs> the lights are one of my personal favorite parts of the room. They are from Costco, and I was worried about putting them over my headboard, but honestly, it works. My dad actually made my headboard out of cedar. I had it in my room downstairs, and I think it's perfect for up here. Over here is my nightstand area. I can't fit it all in the frame. I brought this mirror from my old room, and then I had an extra vine, so I just kind of 
put it over it and I honestly love how that looks I think that that was a great addition my last room was also kind of like the wood and plant vibe and I wasn't sure if I wanted the vines again because I know those are kind of like you see them a lot but I honestly am so glad I did it because it adds a little bit of color and green into the room okay nightstand i was hesitant to leave the coffee here because i know it kind of looks gross but honestly there's usually one sitting here so we can add it as my decor this also it's always there <laughs> this nightstand is from ikea and then i just have some random books down here along with some candles and then i need to put one of these in my car it's the diva scent i use this in my scentsy i use this scent in my car along with the bath and body work scent and then <laughs> i also use a scent for laundry detergent as my decor lack of decor you could say it's just a candle that i had in my room my glasses for when i take out my contacts and then my apple watch that i actually haven't worn all winter break because i forgot my charger and then like i was saying about the sub it's down here it actually looks kind of cute down there. Moving right along. I don't really know how to film room tours, by the way. I kind of am just I'm trying my best here. Next, we have this big mirror, which I think opens up the room a lot. My sister had it when she was in this room, and so we just kept it. I put a vine over here. Got my backpack over here because it's just waiting to be used for next semester. And then my Ikea Alex 5 drawers along with the tabletop. I don't know where the chair is from, honestly. We don't know. I have my computer on here. These two brush holders are from Ikea. This is my hatch alarm clock, which I need to take to my dorm and figure out how to set up with the Wi-Fi. I tried once, it didn't work, but I'm gonna try again. Perfume, Diva scent, and my Scentsy that I'm also taking to college. Over here, I have my big mirror from Ikea. I knew I needed this mirror in my room. I do not have a good body length mirror in college, so when I come home, this is like the best thing ever. Again, has a little vine over it. Did I decorate with my Carhartt hats? Yes, I did. Honestly, I think the colors are just cute. Then we have some vines that are kind of draped around. Down here is my YouTube 100,000 subscribers plaque, which is literally awesome. I was gonna hang it up, but I kind of just sat it there and I think it kind of balances. I don't know, I think it looks good. To the right is my robe. There's not really a spot to put it in my bathroom since I also had to change bathrooms. So I kind of just hang it there, but again, it's going to college with me, so I'm not too worried about it. Over here, I just hung my wood burned, whatever that is, basket with flowers in it. I made it a while ago and I kind of like the aesthetic of it, even though it's not perfect, but I think it looks good. And yes, I hung that myself. Honestly, I don't think I can show you guys my closets because they are a work in progress. They are a mess because I just have a lot of stuff still yet to like put away and organize. I'm gonna avoid the closets for this video. I will say my closet is bigger in this room than my last room just by a little bit. Don't look too hard because it's bad. And then there's just a small one over there that has just some more storage and my Alex 9 drawers. Fun fact, when we first bought the house, the room only came with that little tiny closet and I'll just show you guys a little peek because I know you guys probably are curious. It's just that I have my Alex drawers in there. But that is all that came with the house and then we discovered there was a ton of attic space, so we, we as in my dad and my grandpa mainly, they added on and we got that huge closet out of it. That is awesome on their part. It did not come with this big, huge closet. That's awesome. I really honestly was not excited about getting this room, but for how much I'm here, it's all I need and I've been enjoying it up here. Don't tell my parents I said that because I really made a big deal about coming up here, but it is great and I like it a lot. So that is all I have to show you guys. If you guys have any questions, because I did kind of go through this pretty fast, just let me know. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.